The UN General Assembly adopted a new resolution on North Korea's human rights abuses, which include torture, rape, public execution, and forced labor. According to our Kwon Soa, the latest measures also holds the regime's leader, Kim Jong un, himself accountable for the violations. Take a look. For the 12th straight year, the United Nations' main policymaking body, the UN General Assembly, has adopted a resolution against North Korea's human rights violations. The resolution, approved at the UN headquarters in New York on Monday, not only calls for the regime's abuses to be referred to the International Criminal Court for the third consecutive year, but for the first time it holds the North Korean leadership itself accountable, seeking for Kim Jong un himself to be punished. In another first, it criticizes North Korea's practice of using forced labor overseas. Seoul's foreign ministry said Tuesday that due to the government's close cooperation with key UN members, including the EU and Japan, which introduced the resolution, South Korea's stance on North Korea's human rights situation has been reflected in the final version. South Korea welcomes the adoption of the resolution and once again urges North Korea to listen to the international community's concerns, abide by the UN's measures and move towards improving the human rights of the North Korean people. Some countries like China and Russia were against the resolution and North Korea's mission to the UN reacted angrily to it, saying the resolution serves the political ambitions of the United States to isolate North Korea and destroy the regime. This was the first time in three years and the third time overall that such resolution was adopted by consensus, showing a growing united will to bring an end to North Korea's violations of the basic rights of its people. Konsoa, Arirang News.